Hello, hello, this is George Prince coming to you live again. And I want to uh, bring you another tidbit of information. Uh, and uh, I've heard some questions here and there. People ask me, you know, what are the free things that I can do? I don't have anything and so forth. So it's interesting to ponder that. Because when you quote unquote don't have anything, you only really only have what you know, what you realize you have. Really, you have everything you need. So, the thing that would really be able to set the stage is that anything that is completely free is for you to be able to extend your hand and to help others with no monetary or any kind of enumeration. That's right. You help others with no intent for repayment. You do this now once, twice, or even three times. Now this is your mode of operation and you will carry this through to your entire business no matter how much you make or how little you make. But it is important that you start out with that. You start out with being yourself, finding what you are good at and then rendering no services to others. Let's take an example for instance. I joined the army and I was not very good with computers. To me I was more a mechanical person. If it didn't turn, it didn't twist, and you know, it didn't show me mechanical motion, I didn't understand it. So with computers, it was like far out. Solid state, having no moving parts, no idea what would go wrong. If something went wrong, I wouldn't know a thing about it. But when I joined the army, I picked that skill up somehow, and once I learned something, I passed it on to someone else. And after I was doing this for a while, the knowledge accumulated and I built on it and there was that moment you know, during that stage of helping people assisting them fixing their computers for problems there was that aha moment and I understood computers from that point forward no matter what came up I always had a theory and I knew I could fix it so that's an example and so I do that to this day I go I advise and for my services, I do not charge for my labor on working on mobile devices, computers, desktop software, or hardware, building them, fixing them, replacing components, whatever. The only thing I do, of course, charge for are the replacement parts, which is only sensible anyway. They would buy them anyway if they want the computer fixed. So, but not for labor. Labor is donations. They can give whatever they want to, or they could just not give anything. That's totally up to them. So that's a kind of example of how to work on services. Yours could be in website designing, like mine is. Or, uh, or it could be in, 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 in software designing, or all kinds of different things. Uh, I could only begin to list how many fields there are. You pick yours, you pick what you're good at, and then you offer your services to others. That's my best advice to you, and it's free. Your work is free. If they want to pay you, that's fine. If they don't, they don't. That's not the point. The point is you help others. And you will be you will be really surprised how many contacts that you will have that you would never thought you would run into. High leaders, people who are successful, people who would just be completely blown away by your charity and your ability and the things you know and you just want to impart them to help them. Even the successful people, or we're talking about people that have millions of a thousand dollars a month, they don't make. They they always have a need. Never think they don't, and you can give them the answer to their need, and that is a foot in the door. I do this all the time on a daily basis. And so can you. It's completely free. You don't have to invest in the tools and everything else. Uh, maybe just to start up your get it set up whatever, but. Uh, you know, that's the next stage. You, your labor is free. That may seem preposterous, but it is a very powerful way of making connections and being able to attract people to you to be able to render uh, for, because they'll have the same problem. And it's a roller coaster after that. It's like, and it's all because you offer your services free. You're not selling anything, you're not selling yourself. You're not selling or being an affiliate of products. You're there just to be able to be helpful, whether it's offline or online. 
So that's my tip for the day, and I shall be going for not for long. Your uh, friends, your online successful coach. Have a good day.